Hey, how are you? Lou Mosca, Chief Operating Officer of America Management, and welcome to this edition of Straight Talk. And there was a recent Wall Street Journal article and on LinkedIn News and uh, that uh, people are debating, conversating on whether your compensation should stay whole for you to work at home versus for you to commute to your office. And I have a couple of thoughts on that. The first is that I've never created a comp plan for anybody based on their commute time. It's just never gone through my head. And I'm gonna bet most owners haven't done that. Second thing that goes through my head is there's a quick solution. Everyone should be on pay for performance. So whether your people are in the office or whether your people are working remote or whether they travel on vacation to Europe and they're working, <clears throat> or they relocate to Europe and they're working, if you tie everybody's compensation to performance metrics, whether they work from home or work in your office, you'll never be, you'll never feel like you didn't get the bang for the buck for what you're paying. And I think the minute you start lowering people's pay, you might as well just part company with them. It's just, it never works. It's not a good thing. You might as well just part company with them. But I'm gonna tell you, the solution is pay people a fair wage, put in performance metrics, implement a pay for performance plan that is real and tied to a timeline, and you'll never have to worry about what you're paying folks. It's not so darn complicated where they're putting their fannies in a chair. It should not make a huge difference, okay? Have a great day. If I could help with anything, give a call, 800-743-0410. Anything else I should say, Jillian? She said thumbs up, folks, okay? Bye.